Dennis Hopper is dead. The actor, last seen receiving a star on Hollywood's Walk of Fame, passed away after a battle with prostate cancer. This means so much to me, and, and thank you very much, everyone. He appeared gaunt and had to be helped to the stage in late March, where friends David Lynch, Viggo Mortensen, and Jack Nicholson paid tribute. Hopper's biggest success came in 1969 with Easy Rider. Hey man, everything that we ever dreamed of is in that teardrop gas tank. You got a stranger over there pouring gasoline all over it, man. All he's got to do is turn and look over into it, man, and he can see that. He was nominated for a Best Screenplay Oscar and directed the hippie road trip hit. Hot damn. <laughs> But life was by no means easy after that. Hopper was strung out on drugs and alcohol for most of the 70s before making a comeback in Apocalypse Now in 1979. In the 80s, he was finally committed to a detox program after being committed to a psych ward for his hallucinations. Once clean, Hopper enjoyed a career resurgence, starring in Hoosiers, Blue Velvet, and the Oscar-winning Crash. His private life was nearly as chaotic. He was married five times, including an eight-day union with singer Michelle Phillips from the Mamas and the Papas. He survived by four children. Diane Kepley, The Associated Press.